What's up, everybody? How's it going, everybody? Uh, I am Donnie Bryant, a.k.a. Donnie Dark, and I'm here with my main man, uh, John Thomas. John, what's up, man? What's, what, what's going on with you? Man, I'm chilling. What's up with you, man? <laughs> I'm just chilling. I just got done from practice, man, and it's just uh, it's just been going you know, uphill from there. So um, today is more of an introduction to what we are discussing today um so we are for those who don't know and they're just joining we are laker student radio this is brought to you by a brand new media platform nonprofit organization laker student media we are located in mercyhurst university east 38th street on erie pennsylvania and uh, yeah, and I am a junior redshirted uh, sophomore and, or redshirt freshman. I don't know how medical redshirts work. John, what grade are you? I'm a junior as well. No redshirt though. You're no redshirt. You're a junior no, no. though. I'm a junior. So where? So you? Do you come from a different school or? Uh, no, I've been here for two two years, going on three. Uh, did you change your major? Cause, I did. Okay. So what were you before? I was in sociology. Okay. Why'd you change it? Um. I mean, sociology was an interesting thing to study, but, you know, I didn't like the career aspects of that, so, and, like, my sister suggested to me communication, she said I might like it, and so far I do like it, so. Yeah, it's, it's very fun, trust me. Yeah. And things might be a little slow right now, it might be a little unorganized or out of place, but that's only because I'm, I'm doing football, and, you know, there's uh, my partner, Nick, and he's been helping me out. But even with just that, you know, it's just been a little bit hard just trying to, you know, find the time. That's why I do a lot of late nights because it's just, you know, I, I just have to get stuff done. You know what I mean? So I have to make sure everyone's taken care of. We're going to be doing the um, the icebreaker tournament, which that will be coming up on Friday and Saturday. So we will be there doing the journalism aspect. We're not going to promote anything, obviously, but we are just going to go there, interview some people. Uh, do some B-roll. If you don't know what B-roll is, it's for TV and social media. So we have a Twitter. It is Lakers Media, Lakers underscore media. Um, but we are, uh, what we are trying to accomplish for this branch, and there's about seven branches for Lakers Student Media, but this is the radio and audio branch. What we have planned for this branch is we have planned podcasts, and we are probably going to have a 24-7 radio station up and running and it'll be probably provided to you guys on youtube and or on spreaker now we have the uh, college student free version of spreaker which means we're only allowed to do only an x amount of uh broadcasts up to five hours i believe but that doesn't stop us from going 24 7 live on youtube because youtube is unlimited I already set it up the uh, live streaming, and you know YouTube already hooked that up. Shout out to YouTube. Um, but basically, what we're gonna talk about is just what we are. Um, so, John, uh, you like music? You like hip hop and R and B? Yes, definitely. Uh, who's your favorite artist? Favorite artist? I mean, well, this to right now, mostly I say J Cole, maybe Kendrick. Yeah, I like uh, I like Drake. I like I'm I'm a, I'm an old school type of dude, and so I like Drake. Um, Tupac Shakur, Biggie Smalls. Yeah, I'm kind of uh, into that myself. Yeah, and and obviously you can't go with the classics. You know, what I mean, you can't. There are other classics too that are a little bit newer, like Drake, Lil Wayne, yeah. uh, Fat Joe, and all those. You know, they they you know Busta Rhymes, DJ Khaled. Even though DJ Khaled's more of a DJ, um, you know, he he does um, he does some good work, and that's what we're trying to do and accomplish for a radio station. We will be a oh 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 before I before I say our genre. Our previous radio station that we had was 88.5 WMCE. <clears throat> that was a oldie station, and it would play a lot of uh, music from the 90s, 80s, 70s, 60s, and 50s. I believe that's how far it went. And it was fun. I did an internship there for a year, and then I did an internship at Women 100, which is also a – it's not also. It is a hip-hop and R&B station, modern music. And, you know, it's both – different atmospheric type of radio stations because here you have 
you know, WMCE, which is where you just want to play music, you want to talk about the people, and, you know, you just move on. Whereas with Whammo, it's more interactions with the people. And I'm not saying WMCE didn't do that. I'm saying that Whammo 100 was more, you know, natural, more like you have to, you know, have the people hear what you have to say. You know, if you have an opinion on something that's going on, you have to say it. And so, you know, I decided, and and I met with John and a bunch of other people, and we've decided to have Lakers Student Radio be a hip hop and R and B station. Now, obviously, there is going to be doing being that you know Mercyhurst University is a private school. We have to limit some of our songs that we play, which is kind of unfortunate. But you know what? We um we will you know play the songs that are modern. We will play the songs that are clean. Um, you know, because we do have to play clean music unless if we get approved. Unless we get approved to play, you know, music that's not clean. But I think we have to play music that's clean. And, you know, we'll just go from there. Uh, John, what do you want to, what do you expect from the radio station this year? Unlike previous years where it was just oldies music and it was, you know, the demographic was for, you know, older adults like 30s, 40s, and 50s. What do you want to see more? Just, you know, playing hip-hop and R&B, you know, instead of the, you know, we're young college students. And then, like. Like, the old stuff was cool, I, I guess, but, like, it's not, like, really, it's not our demographic, so to speak. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah, you so you need playing, to understand your demographic. Right. So, we're playing music that, you know, that we're familiar with, and that's, you know, it's new to us. It's our generation. Of course, man, of course. And we gotta, we gotta, you know, just play. This has to be for the students, and that's the one thing I will say sure. that this new program this new radio station and obviously we don't have an fcc frequency license we don't have any of that but you don't need one to have an actual radio station you don't need one in these days you don't need an fcc license maybe back in early 2000s you know yes you you do need an fcc license because podcasting and and uh you know digital radio stations xm radio really wasn't you know around you know during that time it wasn't really that popular me having my own radio station myself 35.5 xm although that you know i had to shut that one down because i'm handling all this um you know you know the the materials and resources we have now will will help us and will be more for the students and that's the one thing like i said that WMCE didn't do really a good job of is you're on a college campus you have nothing but college students and yeah you have some staff that are you know towards oldies and older audiences but your main audiences should be towards college kids and if yeah if you want to play some old school music that's fine do it maybe on a certain day you know throwback thursday have different themes that you know if you want to play oldies music then you can do that but you know, that's just not what it was. And unfortunately, Morseyhurst University sold the radio station and that kind of, you know, messed us up a little bit. So now we have to get back on track. But we are just starting this up and we're also going to be talking about current events. You know, what I mean, now the TV station, Lakers Student Network, is talking about their own events, but they're also giving them, you know, us, you know, the people, their opinions on it. We will do the same thing, except ours will be a lot longer. So how one segment will be for 20 minutes, we can go into this for like a full hour and talk about stories and just stuff that, you know, is relevant towards the topic of the day to day. You know, what I mean, it could be about, you know, um, Brett Kavanaugh that that's dead now. But I mean, the whole Brett Kavanaugh situation, the whole Britney, Sp- uh, Britney Spears, the whole Taylor Swift situation. Trump, you know, and, and, and the first lady situation, all those we can go into much greater detail with in Lakers student radio. And that's the one thing that I love about a radio station is that, you know, while the TV station, yeah, you can talk about it as much as you can and give your own opinions. You can go into more detail with radio. And that's what I like. And you can do it for a longer extended amount of time. So that's what one of the things that we are trying to do here at Lakers student radio. We want the students to give us questions and opinions on certain things and we'll respond to them um you know do you ever feel like john do you ever feel like you can call you want to call into a radio station so if you want to call in give your own opinion you know you think do you think you can you think you want to do that you know if you were a student on Mercyhurst university yeah possibly you know if we're talking about something that i know about something i have an opinion on like why not give it you know of course of course so 
what I believe we can do is that we are, you know, we can do call-ins on the radio, on not the radio, but we can do call-ins on this computer. We're using a Mac computer, and it's by Apple. And what we can do is we can use FaceTime, and what we can do is we'll use, the, you know, when we have it all set up, we can use FaceTime to put in the call-in option for, you know, certain things. And, you know, if students have something to talk about, and if they're listening to us, then, yeah, uh, they can call in. We'll always be live. Oh, and by the way, the website, the app that we are using, and we decided, you know, again, this is all group-based, we decided to use uh, Spreaker. We're not going to do any sound effects because I didn't set all this up yet. So we're not going to do any sound effects, but uh, the Spreaker app is what we are using it is Spreaker. It is both on the Apple iTunes, um, the App Store, excuse me, and the Play Store on, you know, an iPhone or Android or anything, whatever whatever app um, store that you use, that's what it's on. So we are on Spreaker. Um, I will post this on my Twitter. I will post this on the Lakers media uh, Twitter as well. That way, if students want to listen to us, we can do that. And also... We can also post our stuff on YouTube as well. YouTube will be our base of operations. So anything that comes up that we want to save, we can put it onto YouTube. And if they want to, you know, recap on streams, that way it just saves us space. And, you know, because YouTube is unlimited. We can have an unlimited amount of videos and, and whatever we want. You know, with Spreaker, it's a little different. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, anything else that you want to say, you know, what, else, what other stuff you want to expect when working here? You said, I think you said it all. <laughs> I'm sorry. Honest. Yeah, no, I'm, I didn't know, that ain't no issue. You know, I mean, I I'm I'm experienced with this. Like I said, I've I've had years and years of experience in radio, yeah, and and it's just uh, yeah, he's a new guy. We also got another guy too, Michael Nunez, but he's out of town right now. Uh, he will also be joining you guys. I think we're gonna separate the shows by you know certain times. Pre, some of them will be pre-recorded, others will be live. Um, you know, again. Follow the Twitter. That way you can know, like, hey, if it's a podcast or, hey, if we're just live. You know what I mean? Just just for us to give our opinions on certain things. And, uh, you know, movie reviews, that's another thing that I want to get into as well. You know, if you ever seen the Ben Shapiro show, that's pretty much what I want to do. And eventually we're going to get to a point where we can get a webcam and add video towards the radio station. Because some radio stations are doing video nowadays as well. Uh, like the um, Shade Forty Five, Sirius XM, all those stations, all those all those companies, they're they're doing Mike and Mike in the morning, ESPN, you know, all those all those stations are doing video. So I think we'll we'll get into that as time goes by. But uh, yeah, anything else you want to say, John, before uh, we cut out? Nothing else. Um, you have a blessed evening. <laughs>